Yesterday, I was scrolling through Facebook and I saw an advert for a new toy and I thought it must be a joke and then I realised, of course, it's 2019 and sarcasm is now illegal. But the toy in question is the new Ken doll, with Ken being Barbie's life partner. And to check what I've seen was legit, I went onto Mattel's website and was surprised to see that they list Barbie and Ken dolls as toys for girls. Because I didn't think children were allowed to be girls and boys anymore. I thought they were all born gender non-specific entities. The only time you can say you've got a daughter is if after years of hormone treatment, she's having her penis cut off. But the new Ken doll is called Career Ken, a toy designed to teach children about the wonderful world of work. So what career do you think Ken is doing? Well, he's a barrister. I thought that's a bit complicated for kids to get their head around and realise, no, he's a barista. He works in a sodding coffee shop. And there's nothing wrong with working in a sodding coffee shop. Or being a barista, provided you're not one of those ponty twats who claims that they're an artist. Because let's be blunt, you're selling caffeine. You're on the very bottom rung of the drug dealer ladder. Also, I don't want to boast, but I've not had any barista training, but I know how to use a fucking kettle. I also miss the days when coffee was black or white and then you picked if you had sugar, and that was it. Because something I hate about the modern world is if I'm standing behind someone in a queue and they're there, and these people always have their phone up about shoulder height, and they'll order a uh, fair trade, lacto-free, vegan, caramel, skinny frappuccino. People like that, I want to throw their coffee into their face and then discharge a firearm into their skull, because it'd just be one less of them. But anyway, Barista Ken, what does he look like? Well, he's wearing an apron, because obviously he has to be a bit more feminized. But the weird thing is his haircut, because he's got a man bun. So clearly, he's a wanker. Because when women don't want to do anything with their hair, they'll put it up into a bun. A man with a bun is saying to the entire world, I am a colossal prick. Also, they tend to be quite short blokes with man buns. They're trying to make up a bit more height. Now, the person I feel sorry for here is Barbie. Only a few years ago, Ken was a fucking astronaut. Now, he's working in Starbucks on minimum wage. I feel sorry for her if they've got a joint account, because for years she's been roaring around in a pink Ferrari. That'll be fucking getting repossessed. Next year's Barbie, I expect, will be living in a bedsit on benefits. Can it get any more woke than Barista Ken? Of course it can. Next year, I expect he'll be calling himself Kimberly and getting buggered by Action Man. Sorry, Action Person.